Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, thank you. Are you begging? She's so happy. <laughs> she is a really happy dog. Can you say hi? In this episode, we're going to be meeting Coco, a 13-year-old terrier mix looking for her forever home. My name is Shadrach Webb, but you might know me as the dog mentor. I'm using my pet photography skills in efforts to help shelter dogs find their forever homes in my self-titled web series called Rescue Me. If you'd like to contribute, like and share this video. Enjoy. soft spot for older pups especially in shelters they're usually the ones I focus the most on today is a 13 year old terrier mix who's been at the shelter for a few months and I am trying as hard as I can to try to match her with a home she's like super strong for being 13 years old Look at my... she's really enthusiastic about walking on a leash she loves being outside watch when we're about to get to this play park over here she's gonna absolutely freak out and like constantly be running and rolling around. Coco is really hard to photograph. I was out here the other day with her trying to get her attention and absolutely nothing gets her attention. Sticks don't, balls don't, even trying to get her just like, you know, like pet her or whatever, nothing. She just, she does this, she just runs around and sniffs. But I discovered a leaf gets her attention. I'll give you an example. I was like, kind of messing around with this the other day because I, I legit was giving up on trying to get photos of her because I didn't know how to get her attention and I was just kind of sarcastic, sarcastically like, let me see if she'll look at this leaf. And you gotta find a big leaf though, that's the thing. <laughs> Ready for this? Coco! What is this? Oh, you see that? Yeah, see, there it is. Look, she's super interested in the leaf. Super interested. Sometimes with dogs, you just gotta be creative. Yeah, see, look at it, it's so cute. You gotta be creative with how you get their attention. Watch, she'll start being vocal with me here in a sec. Ready? What, you want this? Is this something you want? You want the leaf? No. Oh, yeah? No. Oh, you tell me. Can you sit? Can you sit? There you go. <laughs> yeah. And watch, I'm about to really disappoint her. Because she thinks it's all something so special and then it's just, it's just a leaf. So Coco has just been on a recent home trial this last weekend and they had a few good things to say about her. Like, uh, one, she's an enthusiastic walker. Like I said earlier, she just loves being outside and walking around. Um, she's good with cats is what has been reported and uh, she sleeps really good at night. Reason she was returned um, apparently she shows signs of like being nervous uh, like for example she like paces around in circles and she isn't housebroken so she had some accidents indoors as well as in her kennel you know for being 13 years old she doesn't deserve to be in a shelter anymore so the reason why I'm kind of focusing on this episode on her is to hopefully find somebody out there who loves to take in like senior pups and you know, give them a place where they can feel loved until the end of their days. She has a lot of energy for being a 13 year old dog. Like she pulls really hard on the leash. She's constantly running. I, all the time I've spent with her out here, she's always moving. She never just sits down and like relaxes. Us. Oh my goodness. Us, thank you. Are you begging? Us, us again. Us can you can. Us, come on. <laughs> hey, oh, what is it? <laughs> Come here. Hey, girl. That's oh, very good. You're so happy. <laughs> she is a really happy dog. Can you say hi? <laughs> Let's see. No sticks. None of, like, none. Like, she won't go after sticks at all. She'll, like, pick up sticks on her own time. Uh -huh. Like there's like a little twig I've seen her pick up, but as soon as I touch it, she just has no interest in it at all. Mm. Fall background. Coco. 
You want the stick? Do you want the stick? Do you want the stick? Oh, simple. Oh, do you want the stick? Come on. Come on. Do you want the stick? Come on. Go, go. Should we go for a walk around the block? I know you're very interested in this puppy. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Coco is in a very strong need of either a home or even a foster home. Um, she's been here for like two and a half months and being 13 years old, I'd say it's like a high priority to get her somewhere where she can just kind of live out her final days and you know find the right love that she needs. If you want to help out and help us get her adopted, go ahead and like and share this video. Uh, get her face out there as much as we can and maybe we can match her with somebody out there that will take her in. Like I said though, a foster home would even do good for her. Any way we can get her out of the shelter would be absolutely the best thing for her. Oh, hey. <laughs> this is where it can get a little tricky. She's not really a fan of going back inside, which I wouldn't be a fan of going back inside either if I was a shelter dog. Oh. Oop. And that's how you do it. <laughs> Sometimes dogs can see the leash and they know it's about to happen and they'll run away from you. So that's kind of like a dog shelter hack right there if you want to put them back inside. Usually she's pretty easy to put away too. That's a wrap on this episode. If you'd like to contribute and help Coco get at home, make sure to like and share this video. I can't stress that enough. Other than that, I don't have anything else to say. My name is Shadrach, and I'll see you in the next episode.